What's going on guys? Better back with more of the Odin project. And we are on flex information. This is the flex exercise, flex information. It's the fourth assignment. And so the goal of this exercise is to recreate a section that is found on many informational websites. For this one, you will need to edit the HTML a little bit. We can't be making things too easy for you. You'll want to add containers around the various elements so that you can flex them. Good luck. All right, so this is our desired outcome and this is what it currently looks like. So let's get our readme back open and we're gonna wanna do a div class container and then we're gonna wanna close that down here of the body oh my gosh this is driving me nuts that should not be there S slash oh my gosh why does it keep doing that this is very annoying undo undo let's get rid of this Get rid of that. Slash div. Okay, it's closed. Now we need to make containers around the elements. So we're going to do div class. Um, what is this? Info. Slash div. We need to close that. Can I stop this from auto preferences settings text editor? Setting it to on will disable word wrapping auto closing brackets never okay let's see if that actually helps i don't know how to actually save that but let's see all right that is very annoying all right so div class info it's still doing it, so I didn't fix it. Slash div. Div class info. Slash div. Div class info. Slash div. Okay. Delete this one. Let me look at those again because this is. They're both closed. Alright. That should not have changed what our page looks like here. And it did not. Alright. So that should be all that we need to do on the HTML side, but we will see. So. All items are centered on the page, horizontally, not vertically. So I'm going to put this up here, but we need to select a container. And display flex, right? Align items center. Justify content center. Let's see what that looks like, what that did. So this is what it looks like now. And did I save this? Save, save, refresh. 
Let's drag it over again. I'm not sure what's happening here. It didn't do anything. Why did that not do anything? Save. Alright, so we aligned the whole body to center and that centered our information, but the title had to be centered and all items need to be centered. So did I really need the justify and the align? I think so. Um, 32 pixels between the title and the items. So the margin of the bottom of the title needs to be 32 pixels. Save that. All right, that's what it looks like right now. All right, that worked. You guys might ask why I save and refresh so often, but I just wanna make sure that my changes are going in the correct direction. That makes sense. Read me 52 pixels between each item. So in our container, we want to do, oh, you know what? This is not closed. Let's close that and just make sure everything's still working right. Okay. Gap, 52 pixels, was it 52? Yeah. All right, let's save that and see what happens. I don't know that that did anything. Um, the items are arranged horizontally on the page. It's 52 pixels between each item. We gotta select our dot info. Max width. 200 pixels, close that, let's save it, what in the world is happening here? Text align center. Margin bottom. Max width 200 pixels. Display flex, align items, justify content, gap. Body text align. Diff class footer. Display flex, align items, justify content, gap 52, text align. Is everything closed here? Dot container dot info. Div class title information. That's the close for that. Ah. Container. That's the div for that. Div. Div, 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 div. 
They're all opened and closed. Thirty two pixels between each item. We got that margin bottom. Container gap fifty two pixels. Let's save this as styles.css. Save. Replace. Save this as index.html. Save. Replace. So let's go on here. Nothing is changing. Link relative style sheet styles.css. I am not sure what's happening here, guys. <laughs> Seems like something's going on with my virtual machine here. My pointer is broken. What is happening? Let's drag it over. Flex information styles. Dot container class. I don't understand why nothing's happening here. Align cell center. Why is nothing changing here? This just doesn't make sense. Let's drag this over. Nothing's changing. item text is centered. I don't understand what's happening here. Let me put this that shouldn't make a difference but where's our folder here? We got the index, we got the styles, we got the readme. That's opening that. Do not edit the footer. We haven't touched it. Oh, that looks okay. Let's look at the solution. I just, I don't understand. Okay, that's how it's supposed to look. But can we open the actual... Let's open this. Let's look at ours. All right, so that's the only one that's different, but that should be different. Information we got class container info close it info close it info close it info close it. All of that's the same. And nothing else here has changed. So our HTML looks exactly like the solution HTML. And then let's open the CSS and see what that looks like. 
So we got text align center. Oh. So body text align center image we not supposed to do anything to title um, margin bottom 32 pixels we got that container display flex justify content not supposed to have align items The gap is correct, and then the info max width 200 pixels, and I wasn't supposed to have a line center there. So let's save that, and then refresh, and then nothing's changing. I am, my mind is blown right now, guys. I don't know what's going on with this. It doesn't matter what I take away or add. It's not updating the file. So I'm not sure what's going on. Um, if you guys are following along, um, let me know if you're having the same issue. I'm not sure if something got mess messed up with my files here. I don't think so. I mean, the pictures are all displaying properly. I'm just not sure. You guys let me know if you're having the same issue. I'm going to play around with this off camera. But I will see you guys on the next one. And I'll let you know if I figured it out. Bye guys.